Hi, Grandma Mary Show. I am so excited once again to be joined with the fantastic, fabulous Guy Kawasaki. Guy, I love you. Thanks for coming Thank you. Here. Thank you for having me. What, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. It does, huh? Huh? We're in Vegas, baby. Who knows? <laughs> so I am, want to talk to Guy about his fabulous new book, Ape, author, publisher, entrepreneur, yes. and, and tell us a little bit about the premise of this book. Sure, what? sure. So I think a lot of people have a book in them, and they've been thinking about writing it and publishing it, and they've come up upon problems and complexities and confusion, as I did. And so I wrote a book about how to be an author, a publisher, an entrepreneur, which is the basically the three key stages of becoming a successful self-published author. So um, I lay it all out for people. Uh, this is how to publish a book. It's fantastic. It's a way of the future. And and so you've been with publishers before. Yes. What what prompted you to want to self-publish? Why not? Well, you already have the relationships. Yeah. Well, listen, there are some advantages with traditional publishing, such as big advances. Oh, I love, that's a big <laughs> advantage. Everybody gets a big advance, and you make less money per copy. Also, it takes 12 months for a traditional publisher to get a book out. A self-publisher can, from the time you're really done with the book, digital file ready, mm -hmm. it's 48 hours. Mm -hmm. And so it's a very different world. You also get to control the marketing. You get to control everything. Um, I, I like to think of it as artisanal publishing, where you control the content, you control the design, the cover, you control the marketing. It's just like being an artisanal baker, mm -hmm. winemaker, mm -hmm. or brewer. Mm -hmm. And grandma likes to be in control. That's, <laughs> you know, um, but now, what do you recommend? I mean, there's lots of different ways you can self-publish. Yeah. Do you recommend just going up to Amazon, loading it up in there? Well, th that is the simplest path. I mean, right now, if you have a Macintosh or even a Windows machine, <laughs> you write it with Word, you upload it to Kindle, 48 hours later. You're done. Yes, yeah, so but now that's for a novel. For a nonfiction book, if it's complex with tables and captions and pictures and bullets, it's a little harder, and that, that's what I encountered. S still, it can be done, yeah, and yeah. much faster, um, much more profitably, uh -huh. but still, the marketing burden will be on the author. I don't want to paint a picture that it's easy, because yeah. it's not. No, and, and that's it. Anything has to be marketed. You got to sell it. You got to sell your stuff, baby. Get out there. Get out there. Build your audience. And that's even with uh, traditional publishing that's now, too. More so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now, if, you're, if you've got a technical book, would, uh, is there certain routes you go, or do you just hire someone to do the formatting, or are there certain it, it, services? It depends how technical you are. Fundamentally, you'd be going from Microsoft Word. Probably, we recommend going to Adobe InDesign. Uh, that step can be a little hairy. There are people who can lay it out for you. For sure, you should get a professional copy editor. For sure, you should get a professional cover designer. Fantastic advice. I love it, people. So go out there. Where can we get this book? Uh, kind of. Amazon right now. Amazon. It's called Ape, Author, Publisher, Entrepreneur. Ape. Love it. Lo <laughs> right there. Right there on the shirt. Read the shirt. <laughs> All right. All right. Thanks Gotta so much, go. guy. Love you. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> Talk to you next time.